During the holidays, we're always thinking about traditional baking, breads, desserts, and all that yummy good stuff. But sometimes our busy schedules get in the way of baking. Well, today we've got some great ideas that are going to save you time in the kitchen while mouthwatering aromas warm your entire home. And to help us do that, we're welcoming Jean Moore from Bridgeford Foods. Hi, Jean. Hi, Beth. Nice to be here. So thrilled that you're in our kitchen because everything looks and smells fantastic in here. And I'm thrilled to know you don't have to be a professional baker to make this stuff. You know what? You don't. All you need is some Bridgeford frozen bread dough. You let it thaw, rise, and you can bake up all these wonderful treats. So you can make everything from this traditional loaf of bread that right. looks wonderful mm -hmm. to a pizza crust. A pizza crust. All you do is take some frozen dough, let it thaw, roll it out to fit your pan, top it and bake it. You don't even have to let that rise. I could do that. And yeast rolls. These look great and everybody loves these at the holidays because oh. you can sop up the gravy. Yeah, and they're so easy. You just take frozen roll dough, put it on your pan, let it rise and bake. And you have a tray of homemade rolls. And it looks like I've slaved away in the kitchen. Now Absolutely. people need a yummy breakfast at the holidays. Yes. And you know what? This is frozen monkey bread. Mm -hmm. um, we have it in the savory garlic cheese or the traditional cinnamon monkey bread. And I keep my freezer stocked with these because you know when you get all those guests that come by during the holidays, pop it in the microwave, two minutes later you got a nice homemade treat. The cinnamon would be great for breakfast. The savory would be a great hostess gift. Right. You've also got a great recipe for us. I do. This is our pepperoni pull apart. And let me tell you, this recipe is so be a hit at a party. Oh, you know what? With your family. <laughs> this is gone in about 30 seconds every time I make it. I bet so. Yeah, so we're going to use some Bridgeford frozen Parker House roll dough. Uh -huh. We're just going to let that thaw. And while that's thawing, we're going to mix together our cheese and pepperoni ingredients. So you just use some Parmesan cheese, a little bit of oregano, or whatever your favorite herb is. And we're going to throw in some pepperoni. Uh, and this pepperoni is wonderful. It goes through a natural fermentation process. Oh, wow. And it has twice the drying time as a lot of other brands. So it's, oh, the flavor's just awesome. Just a really rich flavor. It's very good. Very, very, very good. You can't beat pepperoni. No, no. And then <laughs> this is the fun part. This is the part where your whole family wants to get involved. Oh, playing with dough. Play, who doesn't love to play with right. dough? And you just simply take those rolls, divide them in half, and you're going to dip them in some nice, yummy butter. Roll it in your cheese pepperoni mixture and place it in your pan. Oh, that's simple. Isn't it? And you, you let that rise. It does that for you. It just rises on its own. And then you just throw this in the oven and it's going to look like this. Yes. You will have this. This is wonderful to give away at the holidays. Put it on a beautiful plate and voila, you're set. It would be a hit at a party. It lasts 30 seconds at your house, probably 15 seconds at the party, right? Oh, <laughs> you won't be. Everyone wants the recipe. Let me tell you. Thank you so much for being here. Great tips. Great ideas. And if you want more great holiday recipes, just go to Bridgeford.com. And we have some more great recipe ideas on the way. These are for the day's most important meal, breakfast. That's when we come back. Stick around.